Hello there. Good morning and welcome to uh, Zachariah 11. Um, the the por major portion of this chapter is on the uh, prophecy of the shepherds. And actually, when you uh, dig into this, you see that it's, uh, it's about shepherds who are, who are actually leading the people wrong. He, the, you know, they're really doing it for themselves. You see in verse 10, it says, And I took my staff called beauty. And cut it in two, that I may break the covenant which I made with all the peoples. Okay, this is, this is, uh, uh, so it was broken on that day. Thus the poor of the flock who were watching me knew it was the word of God. Okay, these are shepherds who are, who are not really preaching the word of God. These are shepherds who, who really, um, they, they, they're, they're, they're preaching and, and lifting themselves up more than they are. The word of God and and you know God is he, he does not like that verse 14 says then I cut into my other staff bonds that I might break the brotherhood between Judah and Israel and and you see here 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 again you see a shepherd breaking the bonds between brothers and and you know and, and to put this into, into you know a life application this you know that that's somebody coming in, in between a brotherhood you know, in the church, you, you know, this is a shepherd leading people against each other, causing division. And this is not, this is not right. And down in verse 16, it says, For I will raise up a shepherd in the land who will not care for those who are cut off, nor seek the young, nor heal those who are broken, nor feed those who stand still, but eat the flesh and the fat. And tear their hooves in pieces. See, God says he's going to raise up an un ungodly shepherd. Uh, he actually gives us an example as you're looking at this, you see what an example of a godly shepherd really is. You know, a godly shepherd is someone who will care for those who are cut off, who will seek out the young, who will heal those that are broken in, in spirit and, and if God feels in, in, in physical, and, and who will feed those who need it. So, it's a good little chapter. Um, you know, it helps us understand what a godly leader should be. You know, we, we are all... Um, in in little ways, one way or another, um, shepherds, you know, there there are people following us. Um, where are you leading them? Are you leading them to Jesus, or are you you breaking them? You know, it's essentially the life life application I get out of this. Are you leading them to Jesus, or are you breaking them for yourself? So, have a great day, guys. I love you all.